Welcome back to New Vegas, everyone. We are here with the squad. Sunny, Cheyenne, Robo, Mr. Handy. And uh, I installed the After School Special mod, which is a mod I've always wanted to play with. And I don't know why I haven't installed it before, but it's good that I have it. Because now it's going to be completely fresh and new to us. Check this out. What are you growling at, Cheyenne? This might be weird going in here because we got the four-legged friends in here, too. We'll see. It's probably going to be a massacre once we enter there. Watch. Uh, watch and see. Explosions. Come on. It's not that bad. Just the four-legged friends chilling in here. How you doing, Digger Farsight? The rest? Mr. Handy just coming out of nowhere. Um, there is supposed to be something in here. Oh, right here. All right? Yeah, right here. There is a bloody journal page. Let's read this. Bloody journal page. William sounds all official, don't it? Haha, <laughs> well, everybody just calls me Billy. Been traveling for what seems like months, but it's really only been a few weeks since I left Shady Sands for New Vegas. I decided to start, I decided to start this journal just in case uh, anything, <laughs> anything happens to me. Maybe somehow word can get back to my wife and boys. I'm out of work. He's carpenters. Duh. Let's get to a part where he dies. Not gonna make it. Can barely write. So much poison. Fingers cramping. Oh god. Casador's no throat. Got me good. Dying. I think fading fast. What was that? Something green in here? Oh no, I can't move. Can't feel my legs. Can't feel my legs. What was that? Oh, Karen. Boys, oh sorry. What a dumbass. If he just waited for me, I could have killed all those Casadors for him. So. We read this here. Does that start a quest? Yeah, it does. Find Paul Edgecombe and show him the note you found. Hey, Paul! Paul Edgecombe. You ain't Paul. That's Dean Stanton. Let's go to Edgecombe Repair. Hello, Paul. Hello. Welcome to Edgecombe Repair. Need something fixed, you can see Dean. I can do some trading with you soon, but waiting for stock right now. Um, did you know Billy Wharton? I found a note I think he wrote in that old school. Damn, how could we have missed that? Well, it was dark in there, and I guess that could have looked like another piece of trash. Did you guys see the We've five to six animals in there? Been trying to figure out what the hell happened to him There's since. a mole rat and a gecko in there. How'd you guys miss that, too? From the looks of this, it looks like Cazador's got him. Can I see that? Yeah, Doc said that's what he thought it was. Looks like he was right. Must have been trying to get to New Vegas up the North Road. I told him nothing but death that way. God damn it, I told him. I freaking tell everybody. Don't take the North Road out of here unless you're committing suicide. Damn it. Hey, thanks for coming to see me. He seemed a good man for what time I knew him, and it helps a little knowing for sure what happened to him. That old bone orchard's filling up too quick lately. Guess not everybody as lucky as you are having nine lives. How do you know that? Sorry about your friend, so was he working for you and fixing up that old school? Yeah, he showed up and was begging for some work. Seemed nice enough, so I was giving the young man a hand up. I was giving giving them. Maybe I'd hire him for some more steady work if he was a go-getter, you know? True. We'd agreed to start fixing up the place and make it live. I was going to let him bunk up inside the old place and work for me whenever I had a... I thought it was a good deal. Make money from me when I had jobs and get a free place to stay. While That's a pretty good deal. I could clean up and do some work on the school if you let me bunk in there. What do you say? Right now, there ain't nothing in there but a lot of junk and a dead man's mattress. You sure you're ready for this? Uh, well, I sorry if I'm fucking burping. <laughs> Just ate food and I wanted to record. These wrenches, they're all different size. You know, you gotta represent the wrenches. Move the hell! Cheyenne! Jeez, man. I'm gonna replace you, Cheyenne. I'm gonna replace you. I'm sorry. Did I just walk through that? I'm sorry to say, Cheyenne, but there's just better animals inside you here. So I'm actually wearing the Mark II outfit for the, the Courier's apparel or whatever the hell it's called. Yeah, Mark II. Because the Mark I broke. And I swear I bought another Mark I, but I don't know where it went. It, like, vanished. But uh, we're supposed to take all these wooden slats and stuff. Oh, wait, where'd the animals go? Four-legged friends are just... They vanished. Huh. Well, that sucks. Do I have a hard save? I might... 
I might recruit all of them and get them to like wait at the lucky 38 or something. Oh, I should do that. Hold on, I'll be right back. All right, so we need to salvage 15 wooden slots from this school. We can do that. I got Digger here. He's the one we're actually going to recruit because I like him. He's different. We can salvage this. Yeah, let's remove it. Requires 18. What? In order to remove the terminal, terminal, you must have found it. What? The heck? All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Get an extra one. All right. And I got 15 slats. How do I do this? Uh, a Braxo cleaner, box of detergent, and mop water. All right. There's that. Some a Braxo cleaner in here. Box of detergent. I know it's some Abraxo. Aha! I figured it out. So I was stupid the whole time. This is there's a difference between scrap wood and wooden slats. The wooden slats are like gigantic. Look, that's a wooden slat. That's scrap wood. Okay, I get it now. I get it. Now I can remove it. Pick up the terminal. You have successfully retrieved the broken computer terminal. Return to Paul with the terminal and 51 slats he needed. We'll go out the back door. I just put, you know, look. See, the terminal obviously fits in that backpack I have right there. Obviously, like, no questions asked, all right? What's going on over there? Hey, Paul. Watch out for the damn geckos down by the source. And I've heard this. Who the hell cares about them? Well, that's fantastic. Floor cleaned up pretty good, did it? That's good news. Sounds very sturdy for its age. Yep. I'll start working on that old terminal while you and Dean do something. To... All right, the windows. Yes, they're all busted and let the weather in. Not to mention all kinds. So you and Dean are going to take them out and seal them up. That's what I found an old recipe for an old Adobe mixture called Wonder Adobe. Should be tougher like than Death that. Claws. Adobe. When it's all set up. Tougher Just than need Death Claws. Just ingredients and mix it up at the workbench. There's one up by the store if you need it, or you can use the one inside. I already have the sand for the mix out and what's left of the shed, but you'll have to scrounge up the Wonder Glue in the water. Wonder Glue. All right. Sounds simple enough, just beat and mix. That's what I do to my day 15. I'm underground back in the sewers because I can't find one goddamn bottle of Wonder Glue. Oh my god, I found it. I found the last piece. It was in Chet's place in one of the toolbox he has. His. He has his. He has. Oh my god, thank you. Thank you. We made it. Get the shit out of here. Watch out. <laughs> Chill, Sonny. All right. Let's travel here. We're fast traveling here. We gotta, we gotta spare our time. Look at that. We're here. Boom. Snap. Clap. That wasn't a clap. What the heck? Man, if I walked there, it would have been quicker. Just kidding. No, wouldn't have. I just took a perk that makes me way better wearing uh, light armor, but I'm wearing medium armor. <laughs> so I might need to switch back to the Mark One for a little bit. Because I took that perk for the early game, but I guess whatever. What the hell? You guys change your mailbox? No. Looks like Paul's not too busy on another one of his harebrained projects. Can't tell you how many of those I've been on. Which is it this time? Oh, I went on the great Wonder Glue hunt. Wonder Adobe? Huh. I'm just wondering if now about I take that tie iron and hammer and you keep the sledge to bust. Hey. Wanna race? Well. Dang, you know, goddamn sledgehammer. Alright, alright, alright. We're gonna race, right? What's the quest? Meet Dean in the school and talk to him about. Oh my god, come on, man, hurry up. I'm ready to. I'm ready to swim. I'm ready to fucking swim. Gotta take out all my rage after searching for Wonder Glue for 20 minutes. Hey. Mm -hmm. Alright. Oh, alright. Apparently, that's not what we're doing. Man, just there's wonder glue in here. What the fuck, man? <laughs> All right, you ready for this? I'm ready to start. Sledgehammer window. Just you motherfucker. Oh, oh my! You and Dean make one hell of a team. First, you use the sledgehammer, and Dean uses tire iron to remove the old window frames. And the truly wondered old chalkboards from behind the school work perfectly to close up and seal the other. All right. Oh man, I thought we were gonna actually do something there. <laughs> I got kinda excited. Toggle lights. Talk to Dean. Ooh. Very nice. Say, 
You're pretty handy with Yeah, thank you. Yeah, that wonder Adobe actually worked. Unbelievable. Might have to find some other uses. Uh, I, I see you, Lou. Now. No? This place is sealed up almost as good as new. No critters, no dust. Real nice. That's a fine piece of work, my friend. Here's your tie iron back and a little something you might be able to put to use. I put these What is it? Wiring note to Paul. Hmm. I'm just gonna take whatever is in here. What? The safe's already open. Alright. Uh go see Paul when you're ready. Okay. Check this out. What's going on in this corner? This corner looks a little bit bigger. Look at this. I don't remember this much room back here. I bet there's wonder glue in here. <laughs> there would be wonder glue in here. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of all this. I don't want this stuff in here. Oh my god, I'm over encumbered. That's not good. What's in the locker? Wonder glue. Who would I expect? Who would I expect? Alright, I'll take all these scraps. Give me all these scraps. Alright, let's let's I'm gonna do a little bit of the after, after school special on my own time here. And uh, I'll meet you guys with some action in the next part. This guy must think he's a fly guy because, oh, there's more people than I thought. Hold up, hold up. Ah, here we go. Ah, 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 ah. Gonna get you. This, this is by far my favorite weapon. Where the hell do you think you're going, man? Where in the hell? Ah, my head. Watch out, robot. <laughs> oh, my. I wasted my vets on the robot. Whatever, let's take out the specialist. Oh, you special, huh? You special. Oh, why, why do you do so much damage? What the fuck? They did like two damage. Fuck you. Yes. Easy. Alright, what'd you have on you, man? Care to share? Needler pistol. Plasma pistol. Wait, give me the energy cells. I need those. Those are important. It's my livelihood. Hey. Here I am in Repcon facility looking for some parts. And this, this ain't a friendly place. On the way here, I ran into like 800. Literally 800 dudes. From like the Jaguar gang or something like that. And that... That wasn't the best thing. I mean, I took them out. I took them out. Wait, do I have a... I'm pretty sure I have a HK... <gasps> I do. I don't got any ammo for it. I got one. One bullet. Look at it. Boom! I really want to use this, man. This gun looks sweet. Look at this. That's sweet, but I'd rather use the ammo on a gun like this. But yeah, I'm looking for certain parts. I don't, don't want to go down there. <laughs> I don't want to go down there. It looks spooky down there. All right, we'll go down here. I'll auto save though, cause I'm scared. Yeah, I'll take all of that. We we'll probably end up using this stuff for Robco certified. <gasps> here we are. I just don't want to run into any more robots. No, I don't. Ah, there we go. The inversion coil. That's what I've been looking for. Thank God. Oh, my. I should have recorded some of the fighting, but it's kind of hard because I had to fight like 500 dudes and it took a long time because I was hiding most of it. But I accomplished it somehow. Look at this pulse grenades. Classic pulse grenades? I don't even know what the hell that means. Uh, well, hello there, Dustwork. Would you oh, like to me, join me? Let's travel together. Oh, oh. Beheaded Robo Buddy. Per Look at him. He's so beautiful and black. Mm -hmm. And so fancy. Look at that. 